Hey everyone, today we're going to be doing something new to me, but not necessarily new overall. Uh, we're going to be ranking my favorite psychic types. Uh, this is the only list I could find with everything updated to Gen 8. I'll link it below. But for those who may not know, uh, psychic type is my favorite type, excuse me. So uh, I often get asked what my favorite psychic type mons are overall or from each generation. Uh, so I thought we have a little fun and, uh, and rank everything so far. Uh, this is absolutely my favorites. This is not in any way saying they're the best. I may mention some competitive things. I enjoy competitive, and having using having used some of these Pokemon, uh, you know that may influence me. Also, the shiny variants will influence my decisions. Uh, I won't lie. Uh, but this is absolutely my favorites, and not necessarily a best. Uh, without further ado, though, oh, there are a ton, a ton of beauties. Without further ado, let's get into this. All right. So first things first, we know, I, w I really wish there was another tier here, but we absolutely know, I mean, you're right, let's, let's just, let's just get these out of the way, right? We already know Spoink and Grumpig, Grumpig my favorite Pokemon of all, um, these are going to be S, absolute favorites, I may put some up there, but let's assume, well, can I, can I, there we go, let's assume it's maybe a descending order for the time, uh, we'll see, we'll see, anyway, all right. Alolan Raichu. Ooh. This is tough. Um, Alolan Raichu. I really like it. I've never really used it much. It's pretty big in 17. VGC 17 with Tapu Koko. Uh, already coming out with that. Uh, I think I want to give it B for now. These are subject to change. Maybe I'll move things. Super cute design. Um, this is a pretty cool mod overall. Yeah, I think we'll go with that. I think we'll go with that. Uh, okay, this is tough. This is t these are I'm gonna say that count how many times I say this is tough uh, Abra, you know, I love Abra. I love that line gen 1 classic one of the best psychics or original psychics, but Abra you don't do much You're gonna have to be in D um, And I'm gonna have to put maybe Kadabra there Mega Alakazam A and Alakazam A. I really like Zam. That's a uh, hmm I'm not so, not so confident in that decision, and we're about, what, four in? Uh, of course, not cutting. Spoink and Grumpig, that's also five. Anyway. Uh, ooh, Galarian Ponyta. Hmm, Galarian Ponyta. One, I have been building a Mimic Team around Rapidash. Uh, the fairy typing, the whole reveal was pretty hype when we, um, when we had the forest scene, and what we learned was the Glimwood Tangle. Um... Again, though, I think I'm going to put maybe you there and you in B. If Spoink and Grumpig are S, it's pretty hard to get up there. Even Zam could be S, maybe. Whew. Oh, goodness. All right. Uh, Slowpoke again. I do like a lot of single sta or first stage or we're not fully evolved mons. Slowpoke's a classic that I can't say I truly love too much. Um, I'll probably end up putting the Megas in the same tiers as a lot of their you know non-Mega counterparts. Um, but we'll have to see. That could be that could be a thing. <clears throat> All right, we got drowsy, drowsy. C, I suppose. Nice shiny. Same with hypno. Hypno was really fun to use when I didn't want to uh, play through with one of, one, of, one of my traditional psychics, Alakazam, Slowbro. <sighs> All right. Ooh, hoo, hoo. See you later, hypno. Ooh, that's a tough one. All right. Execute, I never felt much for. Eggy. Eggy, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Wolf. <laughs> uh, no, it's gotta be. I'm sorry. Uh, Star Me. You know, I want to put it in D because Star is my favorite shiny, and Star Me is not bad, but it's no Star You. However, however, it is a pretty good mod. C. C. Ooh, the mimes. The mimes. Okay, so we have, of course, I should have seen the Ponyta, the Galarians up here. Um,. A lot of people are kind of freaked out by both regular and Galarian Mr. Mime. I've never felt that way. I've never been a huge fan per se, but I've never really felt freaked out. Um, I do like the shiny. I had a really fun hunt and heart gold for Mr. Mime. Again, but I don't want to let that influence me too much. You know, there you go. For Larvae. For Larvae. All right. Uh, Galarian Mime. I don't know. I haven't really used it yet. That or Rhyme. I don't really know too much about it. But I think it's a fun mon. I really just like the Psychic Ice typing. Ah, oh, boy. Boy. We'll put it in B for now. 
put it in B. Jinx, another one, Psychic Ice, uh, a classic Gen 2 mana I used to use a lot in Gen 2 more than anything. But it's just not as good. It's not one of my favorites. Oh, we're jumping right to Mewtwo now. Jumping right to Mewtwo. Okay, I'd give I'd give Mewtwo an A. I, uh, it's a classic. I just don't really. I'm never. Uh, for the, for the, a lot of a lot of people may know I'm not the biggest fan of a lot of legendaries. Nothing personal. I just don't. I don't have a personal attachment to them. Hmm. Um. I guess I'm gonna put this in B. Let's not worry about this being in, a, in the proper order. Oh, all the megas there. That's a. That's a. It's uh, maybe a hot take. I don't know. Here's Mew. Mew super adorable. Mew can go in A. Definitely. Legend or not, it is absolutely adorable. I prefer the pink non-shiny, but anyway. Natu. Ah. Natu and Zatu. I didn't really do too much to them, but they really did hold a special place in my heart. You may notice a lot of Johto things. I don't... Oh, having Mewtwo in B does not feel right, but it is accurate. All right, let's start with Natu. Natu in C... Mm, Zatu and C as well. <sighs> mm, poor Will. Oh, wait. Espeon, definitely B, if not A. I would put, for the sake of it, let's put Espeon up front. Can I Can I do that? There we go. There we go. Espeon, great. My favorite evolution. Controversial shiny. I'll stop bringing that up, though. Slowking. Oh, I'm so interested to see what the Galarian Slowpoke uh, slow evolutions become. Um... But let's see here. We have Slow King. Slow King's a B as well. Slow King probably over Slow Bro. I don't know. Unknown. Neat lore. But I don't... I like the alphabet. Hmm. Interesting. Favorite unknown letter. Probably the exclamation point. <laughs> the question mark. I am going to put it pretty low. Wabafet as well. Sorry, Team Rocket. Uh, Giraffe Rig. Ooh, I love Giraffe Rig. I really do. I really do. Um, hmm. Something I kind of hoped we could get a new form of in Sword and Shield, Galarian. But let's put that there. Put that there. Smoochum. Ah, another one. Kind of have to put it with Jinx, I guess. Whew, this is... This is... This is... I, I really... Maybe we should have had another rank above. The out, the unrankable. Spoink and Grumpig. Uh, we're going to go with... Lugia, where does Lugia go? Oh my goodness, where does Lugia go? <sighs> B, probably. I've always been a Ho Oh fan, but I do, I do like Lugia. As I say, I'm not the biggest legendary fan. Look at them. Celebi, another one, super cute. Uh, I just have, don't have a strong connection with. I'll admit. <sighs> Ralts line, Ralts down. Actually, to be honest. The Ralts line really isn't something I love, and that's that's probably another one of those oofs. But uh, Gardevoir, amazing and competitive. I do like to use it in competitive. Um, I do have one in a Sword and Shield mono psychic team I've been building. Uh, I, I'll give I'll give Guardy the the B, but even Mega Gardevoir is neat. But I have no again. This is favorites. I really have no connection to to using it. Um, you know, Meditate. I'll put you kind of low. Medicham, interesting. Uh, my most, I don't know, most common or the biggest nuisance perhaps for me in wormholes, if you put it that way. But um, yeah, we'll put Medi down here. <laughs> See, this is how you know. This is how you know I have an interesting <laughs> take because I'm going to put Medicham in C and I'm going to put, am I really going to put them in B? No, I'm probably going to put Lunatone and Solrock in C, but I've, I'm a huge Lisa and Tate fan. Psychic type. Doubles gym battle. I don't know. I like double type. I like VGC. Um, ball toy, nothing personal because I'm gonna I'm gonna make it up to ball toy by putting clay doll in B. Clay doll, way, way, way. Maybe A. I don't know. Maybe, maybe. Do I like it more than Espeon? Yeah, maybe. Maybe something about clay doll. I don't know. Shiny, cool backstory. Not that, not that great, of course, but something about it. I don't know if I like it more than Espeon. That's... Hmm. We'll go back. We'll return. We'll return. Chime, adorable. Not much, though. I'll see what... Yeah, nope. Why not? Put you in D. Oof. Uh, ooh. Now, here comes a hard one. Uh, yeah, I know. Uh, ooh. Beldum, hmm. Beldum... 
Bell D. Um, uh, Metang as well. The Metang. Hmm. Metagross up there. Metagross goes up there. B. Always liked Steel type as my secondary. Metagross super powerful. I use the event one. Oh, sorry. I use the event one in as my shiny hunter in uh, at least Gen six. I did a lot. Hmm. <laughs> Lotties. Lotties, Lotties, Lotties. I, wa I know there's two different ones, but they look the same. Uh, as they always did. Let's see. They're going to go and see. Let's see you later. I already made that joke. <laughs> ah, that one stinks. I don't know if I've, how I feel about that one. Ooh. Jirachi. A legend. Mythical. Sorry. But... I don't know. I kind of like Jirachi a bit. B... Deoxys never really did anything for me. I just feel too bad to put it in D. It is D for Deoxys, but I, I can't do that. I can't do that. Ah, baby, though. I really don't have any real connection or enjoyment of Deoxys. Ooh. Mm, again. Again. <laughs> I have Chime above these. And Chingling above those to prove a point. Bronzor uh, as well. <laughs> And Bronzong, definitely a B. Definitely a B. Hmm. I feel like I need some more. Like, S. Hmm. Could S be on B and A? I don't know. Mime Jr., super cute. B. Uh, we've got Gallade. Gallade's my favorite shiny hunting Pokemon. Uh, in Sword and Shield, at least. Um, Taunt, Trick, False Swipe, Hypnosis. I don't want it in D. But as an overall, I mean, that definitely helps it, in my opinion. We're talking favorites. Galate's never. I'm never gonna find another shiny on my hunts again. I put it in C. <laughs> oh no. Uh, Yuxi, absolute favorite legendary. A, right there. I have two. As I said, I didn't like much, but I do like the Lake Trio a lot. Yuxi, absolute favorite. Mm. Uh, ooh. I guess I'll put the rest of the Lake Trio also in C. I mean, there's going to be a lot of C's and D's. Not everything can be amazing, but I don't want to be overly critical. Cresselia, oh, that's that one's up there. I do like Cress. Probably B. Cress might be C. It kind of lost some of my, some of its appeal after being part of Chalk, in VGC. Arceus again. I, uh, <laughs> I'm literally gonna put God at D tier. Okay, okay. That's all. What an ego. All right, Victini. Hmm. Victini. Victory. C. <laughs> Muna, 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 C as well. Uh, Musharna, probably. Goodness. Muna, Muna, I like the Mush Muna almost more than Musharna. But I think they both have to be C. I don't know, I don't know if I like them enough to be B tier. To be fair, to be fair. Ah, oh, Swoobat. Oh, okay. Woobat and Swoobat. Woobat can get a, a D tier. Swoobat, C. Swoobat could almost be B for me. I love the heart-shaped nose. Pretty good shiny. <sighs> okay. That could be... Oh, we'll go see for now. Zen mode. Oh, there's specifically Zen mode. Well, I love Zen mode, but... Um, not much to it. Sigilyph. Again, on my mono psychic team, I'm building in Sword and Shield, but could probably be on D tier. Uh, fabulous shiny. Fabulous. All right. Uh, Gothita. Gotharita in D. Gothitelle C. Maybe B. We're doing a lot of Gen 5 mods. I would put it above these, but let's not pay attention to this order, like I said. Uh, absolutely Reuniclus. Uh, probably A. Reuniclus, one of my favorites. Um, I jumped ahead a bit. I'll put Duosian. Duosian in D sounds funny, but that's C. Solosis. Solosis C as well, honestly. They're, I, I, liked, I like all of them. Those could be Bs. I'm, I'm taking C as just meaning, like, neutral... So maybe that should be B. Hmm. That should be B. Love the space theme with B, E, M, and LGM, but we're going to go with those. Those positions, I think, are pretty fair. Ah, boy. This this C tier may need some cleaning up at the end. Meloetta, no connection. Beautiful Pokemon, though. Delphox, first Gen 6 starter. Uh, had to get the Fire Psychic. Purple Shiny. Is it a B, though? Is it a B? You know, I don't think so. I don't think so. Esper. Oh, Esper 100% a B tier. Could be A, but it's just super cute. Uh, like the shiny. Uh, there, there's just so much behind that mod for me. Meowstick, another one I think C. Although tough. 
NK, super cute. Super cute. I like it. D, probably. Uh, Malamar. Ooh. Malamar is just unique. Contrary, topsy turvy. Really fun stuff. Hmm. NK helped me win a shiny challenge, though. NK, you get that. You get that love right there. C. You get that C. All right. Uh, Hoopa. Now, Hoopa was pretty interesting. It's another one of those where I feel like I didn't. I didn't get a chance to fall in love with the man. Hmm. Hmm. Hoopa. I mean, I would probably put Hoopa Unbound in D and Hoopa at C, but probably D as well. To be fair, I like little little Unbound Hoopa or Bound. Sorry, Bound Hoopa. Ah. <sighs> hmm. Uh, actually, to be honest, as much as a Psychic type, this is my least favorite Oracorio form. I like the Ballet one. I like the Ballet. Uh. Sure, I pronounced that wrong. Orin Guru. Hmm. <clears throat> uh, Orin Guru. Also pretty fun to use in doubles. Interesting and competitive, even if Trick Room's not necessarily my, my go-to strategy. Hmm. I do think... Uh, I do think D, but I'd probably put it up again. I'm above some of those. Savali, no connection. Very good in raids at the moment, though. Very good in max raids. Bruxish. <laughs> up there. Bruxish should be uh, fitting. Oh, not above Esper, but... Uh, I, I, I don't know. I think I think it's a super interesting mon. It's got a pretty unique ability. I ran a pretty fun set with um, paired with a Tapu Lele at one point. Speaking of which, my favorite Tapu also going to be in B. That combo right there. All right. Um, yeah, and I actually ended up getting a shiny in four eggs once while I was just breeding a few to help uh, complete a friend's Pokedex. So it was super lucky and kind to me in Gen Seven. I don't know why I scrolled so fast. Cosmog. Cute Mog. Cosmoem, lower though. Solgaleo Lunala. Uh, Legends, I think that as much as so I like Solgaleo, it's got my two typing. It's essentially Metagross, you know. It's, it's legendary Metagross, but it doesn't have the same connection for me. Although I did have fun riding it through Ultra Space. No way they're D. No way they're D, absolutely. Necrozma forms, I have very little interest in. They're very cool, but. Necrozma forms. You can go and see also. Necrozma itself, though, actually definitely gets a C. Something about these, I'm not sure. I just didn't connect with them. Didn't connect with them. Oh, I was gonna say, where's where's good old Blip Bug? But only Bug. Now we get into the now we get into the new ones and the hard ones. Uh, no, these have all been hard. I will say, Blip Bug favorite mon from Gen Seven. Uh, Dotler's an easy B. Dollar's an easy B. And Orbeetle 100% A. Orbeetle is my new favorite Gen 8 mon. I love the shiny. I love all of the, the sets you can use. Um, even if it's not very good. The G-Max UFO form is pretty pretty great, as we can see. <sighs> another one. Another one that's really hard. The entire hat line. Another one of my favorites. Another one of my favorites. I, say, I, I really think Gen 8 got some great psychic types. <sighs> Oof. Oof. I think what I'm going to do is have to put... Little Hatena, and I'm going to go out of order. I'm going to put Little Hatena and Hatterene, actually, into B. Little Hatena and Hatterene into B. And, and, and maybe a bold stance, but I'm going to give Hatrim the... Uh, am I? I'm going to give Hatrim the A. I'm going to give it the A. Although in that rate, I think I need to give Espeon an A. If I'm going to put Hatrim up there, <laughs> I, gotta, I have to put Espeon up there. Okay, okay, that makes me feel a little better. That makes me feel better, okay. Uh, and the last, of course, we are last three. Uh, we've got the rhyme. I don't really know much about it. Great mustache. Um, <laughs> pretty cool looking overall. Uh, again, I just don't don't know much. Now, Ndidi. Ndidi was a mod I definitely fell in love with. I still haven't done a shiny hunt for it, but I'm interested to see what we have here. Let's see. Um, let's see. I guess these have to both go in B as well. I don't care for one over the other, even though you tend to see female use more in VGC. Hmm. All right. I'm not really sure how I feel about this. Let's take a look. Let's take a look over this. Okay. We've got the Zams there. That seems fair. Sloking. I've always kind of liked that could be bumped up a bit. Uh, bronze. Bronzong, I think, can go to A. Bronzong, I think, can go to A. Hmm. Though Metagross. I'm trying to not put too many things into A, right? That should be a sort of special category. That should be a special category. 
Uh, aside from S, ideally, hmm. I don't know. I, I may have to put Metagross over Bronzor there, but that's a tough call. That's a that's a hard pick. Hard pick. I almost feel like moving Solrock and Lunatone up, but you know, I think I think this just about does it. I think this just about does it. I admittedly I kind of surprised myself here. <laughs> I wasn't quite sure. Uh, I wasn't quite sure how I felt. I mean, I don't know. Metang and D. Metang and D. I, well, what's done is done, I suppose. Uh, if, if you end up watching this, let me know what you think. Again, I'll link this below. I'd love to know uh, some of the ones you put top tier. But yeah, with that being said, uh, <laughs> take a look for yourself. I'll leave the, the link to this down below. And uh, I hope you enjoyed. If there's any other rankings or silly kind of stuff you'd like, uh, again, let me know. And uh, take care of yourselves. Have a great rest of your day or night. Bye.